Games are a form of escape from the many mundanities of normal life. It's a medium that thrives on providing a sense of escapism to the players. And what better way to provide that escape than indulging in a power fantasy? One that allows you to let loose and wreak havoc upon their adversaries with very little effort. To that end, here are 15 games that give you boss-like superpowers. Prototype Radical Entertainment's Prototype might be the most obvious candidate for such a list, and with good reason. The game sees players assuming the role of Alex Mercer, who's been inflicted with a deadly virus that has given him a plethora of superpowers, ranging from the ability to consume and disguise anyone to jumping across buildings and gliding through cityscapes, and many more. Using these powers, you can make short work of almost anything and everything that comes in your way, and it feels really empowering to say the least. Infamous Much like Prototype that we discussed before, Infamous also provides the protagonist with a fully decked set of abilities that you can use to overthrow anyone standing in your way. But unlike Prototype, these abilities are bound to your moral choices in-game, which allows for some interesting variety in how your character grows over the course of the campaign. But regardless of whatever path you take, you are going to become the bearer of destruction for anyone foolish enough to stand between you and your goal. Metal Gear Rising Revengeance Developed by Platinum Games, Metal Gear Rising Revengeance follows the story of Raiden as he faces the Desperado Enforcement. He's now a cybernetically enhanced swordsman that can use his katana and wits to slash through anything and everything in style. And the game makes full use of these abilities through interesting gameplay scenarios and stylish combos. You also have a robotic dog companion alongside you on some missions. And the slow motion blade mode is just the icing on top of this very lovely cake. Marvel Spider Man Miles Morales. Everybody get out! Everybody out! Don't worry, I got you! While there have been countless iterations of the titular webhead in video game form, Marvel's Spider-Man Miles Morales is easily one of the best ones to date. So it stands to reason that it's going to explore the full extent of Spider-Man's abilities as well. In addition to the standard assortment of web powers and super strength, Miles also possesses some special Venom abilities that allow him to turn invisible or blast his enemies through shock blasts which can be chained together to finish off hordes of enemies in style. Hulk Ultimate Destruction When talking about games that make you feel like a superhero, it is impossible not to mention Hulk Ultimate Destruction. Radical Entertainment's rendition of the frenzied Hulk is as chaotic as it should be, and you can wreak havoc to the city's many environments using your super strength. In addition to being really strong, Hulk is also pretty agile, which makes him a force to be reckoned with. Dishonored 2 Dishonored 2 gives players plenty of powers to choose from, and using them smartly can make your character really powerful. Take for instance Emily, who has access to dark powers like Mesmerize, which can be used to trap two enemies to a point. After performing that, you could use Domino to link these enemies together and jump from the skies above for a quick multi-kill. Furthermore, Corvo can even utilize Plague Rats to devour or clean up corpses alongside his other deadly abilities. Using these violent powers might take a hit on your in-game morality, but it can be pretty fun regardless. Control Remedy Entertainment's latest puts players in the role of Jessie Faden as she clears the FBC from the Hiss presence. Thanks to her discoveries of objects of power within the building, she gains a slew of new abilities, including but not limited to levitation and mind control, alongside the ability to throw pieces of concrete at the enemy. 
Furthermore, her weapon of choice, the service weapon, can also shapeshift to make for some interesting variety in gameplay. Batman Arkham City While Batman might not be as ferocious in a direct encounter as many other candidates in the list, he can certainly close the gap with his impressive hiding skills. Using the many gadgets under his belt, Batman is able to induce a sense of fear into his opponents, which is demonstrated clearly through the combat system in Batman Arkham City. And even when kicks and punches do start to fly, the Dark Knight is no slouch in that department as well. Dynasty Warriors 5 Set against the backdrop of the Chinese novel Romance of the Three Kingdoms, Dynasty Warriors 5 puts players into epic battles with dozens upon dozens of enemies to fight and objectives to capture. You take on the role of a master warrior who can finish off multiple enemies in one fell swoop. There are times when you clear out hordes upon hordes of enemies, all in the span of a few strikes, and during these moments, you can't help but feel like an overpowered boss character. While Dynasty Warriors 5 might be a bit aged, the gameplay remains one of the better ones in this long-running series. The Darkness Developed by Starbreeze Studios, The Darkness has you controlling Jackie, whose body gets inhabited by strange demonic extensions. And through using these demonic extensions, players can make short work of their enemies. You can make a shield out of these extensions, lift targets into the air, or spawn a black hole that consumes anyone caught in its radius, making you the ultimate bearer of death and destruction in the cold and dark night. Just Cause 2 While series protagonist Rico might just look like a regular mercenary at first glance, he is anything but. He can take tons of bullets to his chest and still keep fighting. He can use his wingsuit and grappling hooks to climb buildings and cover great distances. And yes, he's really good at blowing stuff up as well. Just Cause 2 makes great use of these abilities by putting players into interesting and varied scenarios, such as the final boss fight where you literally make your way to the boss by grappling on fired missiles, which might sound over the top, but is definitely cool as well. Metal Gear Solid 5 The Phantom Pain While Venom Snake's preferred way of getting through missions is to sneak through enemy patrols, that doesn't make him any less dangerous than any other agent of destruction. Players get to choose from a wide variety of tools to get through situations. You can make ballooned duplicates of yourself, distract bodyguards by impersonating a cardboard model, shoot rocket launchers, or if that's not enough, you can even shoot your prosthetic arm into an enemy's face to knock them down on their feet. Middle-Earth Shadow of War While Middle-Earth Shadow of War was the subject of many controversies at launch, the game was a worthy sequel that built upon the ideas of the original, including, but not limited to, making you feel like a boss. Talion is a nimble and powerful character, one that can slash through entire waves of enemies using his wits and strength. You can also take control of orc captains to build an army of your own, which you can use to storm the gates of any opposing factions. Quantum Break Quantum Break sees players controlling Jack Joyce, who comes in possession of the time travel powers, and using them, he can make short work of anyone who stands in his way. He can make explosions by stopping time, cover great distances with a blink of an eye, or stop bullets in their tracks, all of which is displayed with plenty of pretty visual effects, not to mention that it looks absolutely cool in gameplay as well. Mortal Kombat 11 While every character within Mortal Kombat's universe is pretty powerful in their own right, a list like this needs to feature Shang Tsung. Using your soul-absorbing powers, Tsung can shapeshift into other characters and take on their abilities. He's also the right-hand man of Shao Kahn, and he is absolutely worthy of that position. Mortal Kombat 11 features one of the most powerful renditions of this character, which also allows you to experience him dealing all kinds of fatalities and injuries to his enemies in high definition. So, what are your thoughts on this? Go ahead and share them in the comments below. 
And if you like this video, please subscribe to the channel and enable all notifications by clicking the bell icon to get new video updates. We upload every day and would really appreciate your support. Thanks for watching.